Hello everyone, it is Katie here and welcome back to my channel. So for this video, I decided to show you guys some of my favorite songs that I have been loving and listening to constantly. These songs are ones that I will crank up in my car, dance, jam out to because I find they are so, so good. As you're watching this video, maybe you will find some songs or artists. Maybe you'll start listening to them too. Maybe it'll just give you some suggestions. I don't know. I'm always for listening and discovering new artists. Every song I'm going to play it like a small little snippet just so I don't really get like copyrighted for that but I'm gonna play like a small snippet of it and you know we're gonna go from there let's start off let's let's just dive right into the spring playlist shall we so the first song that I've been really loving recently is a song that a band called New Hope Club literally just released and called Love Again and holy crap I remember I was listening to it when it got released and I was just like Wow, I was like, this is a really good song. You guys know, like, I do listen to New Hope Club quite a bit because I really do love their music. A little snippet of the song Love Again. Even just, like, the opening of it, I could already tell it was going to be a good song. The next song that I've been super, super into is If I Can't Have You by Shawn Mendes. When he released this song, I was like, another banger. Shawn Mendes is like the king of releasing banger music. Like honestly, I don't even remember the last time that Shawn Mendes did not release a song that I didn't like. He is literally so talented that he can just write and produce music that is so catchy and that just everybody loves. And that's so hard for an artist, but like Shawn Mendes knows exactly what he's doing. Like, So the next song that I have also been really loving and really listening to is the song Me by Taylor Swift featuring Brandon Urie. This song reminds me of like the 1989 Taylor Swift vibes. Like I really, really thoroughly enjoyed it and 1989 was definitely one of my favorite albums that she's ever released. I don't like country music so like her older stuff, like I liked it but I wasn't like obsessed with it. So when she released Me, I listened to it and I just instantly got like 1989 vibe. Little snippet of the song Me. So the next song that I've also been really loving is a song called Kill This Love by Blackpink. A K-pop female all female group which I think is really cool. Like I love all female groups, especially Little Mix. You guys know like Little Mix is the bomb to me. There are some like English words and sentences in the song so it kind of makes it easier to listen to. So here's the little snippet of Kill This Love by Blackpink. Like just like the opening, I'm like, this is so good. Another song that I've been really into recently is NASA by Ariana Grande. This song came out like a while-ish ago. But like, I just love this song. I just will continuously listen to because I think it's really, really good. It's a great Ariana Grande song. So here's a little snippet of NASA. Next song that I have been super into recently is Dazed and Confused by Ruel. I think that's how you say it, Ruel. I was watching people's like different playlist videos because of like, covering new music and this was, song was one of them and I was like, I was like, this is so good. Like, this is so catchy. Here's a little snippet of Dazed and Confused. So the last song that I've been loving is Cool by the Jonas Brothers. Literally, when the Joe Bros said that they were coming back, I was pumped. Like, my eight, ten-year-old self was like, Okay, okay, let's do this. And they really sucker, and sucker is such a good song. I, like set the tone for what the Joe Bros are coming back with. Then they released their song Cool, which I was also like, a fan of. And if you haven't heard Cool, I don't really, I don't know what you're doing. Also going to see the Jonas Brothers in concert, and I cannot wait because I was like the unlucky person that never saw the Jonas Brothers when they were like released Burning Up and Love Bug. I cannot even express the excitement 
we're going to see the Jonas Brothers live because I know it's gonna be so good. Anyways, here's a little snippet of cool. So anyways, that is the end of this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys maybe have some new music to listen to. If you did like this video, make sure to go give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You just gotta click that button. And also, don't forget to put on my post notifications. You just gotta click that bell button and you will be notified for every single time. I post a video. Don't forget to follow me on all my social medias as well. Both my Twitter and my Instagram will both be in the description below. So make sure you go tap those follow buttons. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!